Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to build a bit.ly link. Okay, so this is in the least that we can do process. And this particular task is we have been told here, this is the task to gather a bit.ly link um, for this customer here. So this will be the instructions. Okay, so uh, there's going to be two resources that you can use. Um, one, you will click this video and uh, you can watch how to build a bit.ly link, this right here. The second link right here will take you to bit.ly.com to where you can actually build the bit.ly link. Okay, so these are the resources. And what we're going to do this for, this is going to be for um, Williams Insurance Group for Travis Williams. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys um, the best way to do that, uh, how to do that right now. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is you're going to open a new browser and who is it that you were looking for? So it was going to be Williams Insurance Group, Franklin, Tennessee. Um, and so the first way is you want to see, is this someone you want to give a Google review to or for? And you can see that they have 73 reviews. Um, they care about Google reviews or they don't, you don't accidentally get 73 reviews. So in this particular case, yes, this is somebody I want to get a Google review for. The best way to do that is to uh, scroll down here um, to write a review and so there, well let me say this there's a couple different ways so um you can click on the maps but ultimately when you get to the maps or whatever you're going to land on this card for them that's going to have their uh their company name and their reviews okay so you could go to the maps and do it or you can do it here depending on the type of agent it doesn't really matter so you'll click on this thing here and it's going to open up that same panel that we had. Okay. So what you'll wind up doing is, um, let's see where we can actually write a review for these people. And you'll scroll down and just get to where you can write a review. Now, once you get to where you can write the review, okay, then you will want to go in here and you can copy this link there. So, I'm also going to go back and copy this review link here. And I believe this is going to be the same, the same link either way. So we'll copy it, but you do want to make sure that it's got this here for them present. Okay. Cause this will be a different URL. Once you've got that, then you will go back over into your tab and you can go into bit.ly click here to build your bit.ly link. And I haven't built the bit.ly link, so you'll log into bit.ly. And so uh, what you'll do is go to create. You'll paste the long URL that we just copied and hit. So it's going to create it. So we're going to say um, review. Williams insurance. Okay. And then we're going to put a uh, title at something. So do Google review and who it's going to be for Williams insurance group. Okay. And hit save. <clears throat> now, once you've hit save, I want you to go up here and hit copy. And then I want you to open a, incognito window and paste it in there and you want to make sure that it takes you right here this is fine so once you get signed in this will take you where you want to give them the review if it doesn't take you here that's not the one you want so now we're good so we're going to x out of this guy and we can x out of the bit.ly link and so now um we've still got it in our browser so now the next thing you want to do is you need to get the bit.ly link here. In order to do the bit.ly link, you need to click on the actual company here, okay? When you click on the company, you'll scroll down, you'll see the bit.ly link there, and you will paste that bit.ly link and click submit. Okay, so now you have submitted. So that will now have the bit.ly link um, where it needs to be for that contractor. So uh, now you need to get back to where we just were. So we can, I have a shortcut built. Um, and so I'm going to go into the least that we can do process. 
and we're going to go back to the Williams Insurance Group. And if you don't know how to create a shortcut, check out the video for that. Okay, so now we're going to go back into our tab and we've pasted that. So it should be good. So now that we're here, what I would tell you to do is maybe um, refresh that page and let's hit complete. And you can see that now that we've hit complete, that the bit.ly link is visible. Okay. And if you want, again, if you want to hit it, you can click on it again, just to check it and test it out. And you can see that we're good, but you do want to make sure that you've tested it. Okay. So now that is how you will add and build a bit.ly link for your customer and add it to your process.